Headlamp, bubblegum. Does this equal fire? You bet it does. Today we're gonna take a look at how we can utilize parts of these two items in order to make a fire. Now it might not be the most hardcore survival skill I've ever taught on here, but it's a fun one. It's something that at camp, like think of it as like a camp trick or like a camp party favor. Is that what you would call it? No matter what you would call it, it's something you can impress your friends with because most of them aren't gonna be able to start a fire even with their fire starters anyway. And when you bust this out, you will be like a god or goddess at camp. And then you can sit back and make them do all the work from then on out. So let's just, let's get into it right away. First thing you're gonna have to do is grab your headlamp and you're gonna take the batteries out of it. All you need is one battery and then, uh, I don't know, throw this off to the side. The second thing that you're gonna need then is good old bubble gum. Now I'm not a big bubble gum um, fan, like I don't walk around chewing bubble gum a lot, so I just grab something at the store. But here's what's important. Don't buy the fancy containers. You need to buy the semi, I guess old school at this point, um, gum that has the foil wrapper. So take that wrapper out. You can chew the gum if you want, or like this gum loses a flavor in two minutes. So just get rid of it and keep the wrapper. This is what's real important. So here's how you're gonna do this. You're gonna take your gum wrapper and of course take your piece of gum out of it, okay? And then um, all you're gonna do is you're gonna take your knife and we're gonna make a very thin sliver of this, about a quarter of an inch. Okay, so now we have our quarter inch strip. What we do is we fold that in half. Now where we fold it that, we're gonna trim that down because we want the center of that, okay, when it's open up to be thinner than a quarter inch. So all I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut at an angle here, okay? And what that does is it makes the center of that, okay, nice and thin. Okay, now all that we need to do is we're gonna take our battery and we're gonna touch one of the foil sides to the one side, all right, the positive side, and then we're gonna take the other foil side and touch it to the negative side. That's gonna heat up the center point. As you can see, it's starting to smoke. And there we go, we have an open flame. Now that flame, of course, didn't last extremely long, but we still achieved fire. Look at that, bubble gum makes fire. So maybe not exactly, but again, another good skill, another tool for that toolbox, and a fun one at that. Now, I know what you're probably thinking, well that flame lit up and went out real, real quickly. But the thing is you need to team this up with something else. So it's no different than a flash tinder. If you go somewhere and you find something like cattail fluff and you light it up and it real quick lights up and goes away, or an, uh, a match, or one of them strike anywhere that we don't like at all. <laughs> if you had one of them, they go out quick. So the same concept here, you wanna have everything prepped, that little flame can light something. So think of a candle, think of birch bark, think of something also like fat wood to team that up with and you'll be golden. So another tool for the toolbox, hope you enjoyed this video, fun one, show the kids, show all your friends, um, bet them a beer, you can't do it, and uh, uh, you'll have a great day. You don't even take anything to camp because you're gonna win all your food and your drinks and uh, impress everybody. This was Dan Wolak of Cold Cracker Bushcraft. As always, check us out at coldcrackerbushcraft.com, and until the next video, stay in the woods.